help. Please help. Help. Please help me. Please help me. Help. Who are you and what are you doing here? Please help me. Please. I can't find my way home. I don't know how I got here. Please. Help me find my way home too. Please help me. Okay, this is not a place go. I can't stand up. Help me stand up, please. How? What happened to you? Just help me stand up. I can't stand myself. How dare you! <laughs> I shall have you for a meal. I was with last night. Hmm. You give me double hand. Eh? So you? This is the more reason why I have to keep taking them one after the other. Now I don't have to wait to be a nogi before I can test all of them. Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> but my prince, you know when you become the nogi, all the women in the community will be at your beck and. Hey, my friend, stop that! Stop it! Give me hundred reasons why I should wait. And the mother will not allow these maidens to rest. I am the prince of this land. I have to test all of them so that by the time I, I become the Enoge, I will not know which one is good for me. Ah, yes. Prince. Yes. Mm. Because you, you don't even have the right to test because you are not the prince. Okay, okay. Sorry, T. I will see you later. Okay? I want to attend to something. It is time to take care of your feet. Thank you. I don't need it. I'm only interested. Mary? Yes, my lord. You may go. Okay, I will. Thank you. Thank you. My lord, you cannot continue to do this to yourself. It has been three months since the queen joined our ancestors, and you still act like it was yesterday. Uh, how do you expect me to forget so soon? She was my first wife. I know. But... Thinking about her for a very long time will not turn back the hands of time. I know. But deep down in me, it still hurts. I know it is difficult. But you have to pull yourself together. 
Remember, you have your sons to look out for. The Duke Don, and I, your queen, I am here for you. Uh, how are my sons? They are fine. They are in their chambers. You keep an eye on them and uh, make sure you show them equal love. I will. My lord, please let's go inside. You need to rest. Please. Uh, you go. Go. I will join you very soon. Gods of my mothers, I have come to say thank you. In you lies the strength of womanhood, the one who decides what the next day will be. I have come to say thank you for the unseen battles you fought for me. I called you once and you answered me. With this little sacrifice, I am confident that you will answer me again when I call. Please protect me the way you protected my mother and the ones before her. He said. Mm -hmm. My lord, let the gods take control in this matter. Rebelling against the throne will not buy you their support. Abusa, what do you know about the gods? Don't you know that when men refuse to make moves, the gods are helpless in their matter? If the queen of the land is your cousin, as you said, the crown is not completely lost. Yeah. Be patient, my lord. That's what you will say. See, so you see, have you forgotten? Or let me remind you if you have forgotten that this throw, this crown was formerly in our lineage. It only shifted because there was no male child to wait then. And my own bed came so late. Okay, now that there are so many male children in the family, why would the throne not come back? You know. Let the gods answer that. Eh. The gods answer that. The gods will answer that I'm very fast, or else there will be a problem. So what are you insinuating? What are you trying to tell me? What I want to tell you is that there are some things happening in this palace that is not according to our customs and traditions. Your father might not do everything. That is completely blame him. If my father is the enogi of this land then whatever he does not know does not exist in our tradition who told you mm -hmm. who said so see let me tell you that will help you to recognize your resources when you eventually become the enogi see you are being cheated and you don't even know and there's nobody to tell you hmm. do you know that chief Emata, as the chief advisor to the throne He's supposed to come and wake you up from your bed every morning. Oh, you don't know? Do you know that you are also entitled to a percentage of the homage that is paid to the palace by the people? Yes, mine. Hey, that will teach you how to utilize your resources when you eventually become the Nuki. You have been cheated and you don't even know. Huh? I just don't want to tell you. Hmm. Are you sure of everything you are telling me now? <laughs> See, it's only your mother that would have told you this. But she is no more. Then I will do my findings. Good. Do your findings. But 
don't tell anybody what you have just discussed. There are other ways to find out. Hmm? What other ways? <laughs> that is why you have to listen to me. Hmm? Just give me a little time. I will find out what the next step that we will take. Hmm? Just as I wish. Why? Will I, in the name of the gods, deprive my son, my own son, of what I enjoyed as a prince? Uh, my son. Father. If you want to know more about our traditions, go to the Ohe. I mean, the high priest. His lineage has been the bridge between the gods and the throne. So, Father, why is Otiti saying all these things if they are not true? What does he stand to gain? My son, not everyone will be your friend when you shall ascend the throne that you must know now. So father, what should I do? Nothing. Nothing. Mean nothing? Absolutely nothing. Say these words to no one else. Allow the gods to have their way. I thought marrying from his lineage would put a stop to this fight. Well, but, but I don't regret it. I don't. Mm. What are you doing here? The prince asked me to get some help from brother. Okay. And how is my prince doing? He's doing fine. What about you? Where are you going? I, I, I'm rushing home to head for this trip. Okay, bye. Smiling. You're the priest of this land. I'm collecting water from you, your Franny. Eh? Is something wrong with you? Now get out and get lost. Smile! Sweetheart. I'm Prince. Yeah, my dear, how are you? I'm fine, my Prince. Thank you. My Prince, what are you doing here without your other guards? Ah, leave that for me to worry about. Anyway, I, uh, do you remember what we discussed the last time? Yes, my Prince. Very good, very good. And that's why I'm here. Okay? You see, I'll be taking a wife very soon. And I've made up my mind to 
I choose you to be my queen if only you make up your mind right now. <laughs> yes. This is my prince. Okay. Uh, I have to go and fetch water for my mother as soon as possible. I promise I'll meet you up next time. My mother is waiting for me. Last of that. Look, it is not just about going to the river that matter. It is all about bringing water home, okay? Yes, my uh, friend. So, if you know that, no problem. Come here. Don't worry. Come here. My prince, it's not only to ask your guard to seize their pots. These girls should be flogged. You, these girls, everybody knows that Prince Uwadia does not go to the stream with commoners. Why choose today to go to the stream? Jump! Keep jumping. Keep jumping. Now! Keep jumping until I ask you to stop. Hey, 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 what is going on? Huh? Stop, stop jumping! Why are you humiliating your subjects? Please, tell me. Who says I can't discipline commoners with no regard for royalty? Because no sons and daughters of this land deserve that choice to be given. Why? Because I am the elder. I have every right to correct you when you're going wrong. The last time I checked, the difference between our ages is just 14 days. And 14 days is a whole lot. 14 days means nothing to me. I am the prince, the possible heir to the throne. You cannot tell me what to do just because you're 14 days older than me. I am not here to battle words with you. But since you have refused to listen to your elder brother, I am going to report this to Father so he can inculcate in you vehemently that what you're doing is wrong. <laughs> you can go. Go! You get bring down my royalty before commoners? And what will you do? We shall see. We shall see about it. Hmm. <laughs> He was raining insult on his elder brother. <laughs> Somebody that had a mind to beat up an elderly man. Who then is his elder brother that it, he cannot insult? Thanks to the gods that is not the firstborn. Who knows what would have happened to this kingdom after his father? Maybe that's why he's so furious. I just can't wait to get home so I can report to my father. <gasps> I'm sorry for the woman that we agreed to marry that tyrant of a prince. Please, please my friends, you people should calm your voice down. You don't know who is in the bush. Please. Please. My son, you sent me. What is it? Mother, you cannot believe what just happened today. What is it, my friends? You needed to have seen how I was humiliated, disgraced, and downgraded. In this kingdom? By who? Oduna, my half-brother. That cannot be true. Not when I am alive. Vosolo. Oduna spit on my royal integrity before commoners. Simply because I was trying to teach those commoners the gracefulness that comes with royalty. He came uninvited and began to talk me down. <sighs> Oduna. Calm down, my son. I will not take it. I will not take it. I am a prince to be respected and not to be insulted. And I say, calm down. It is my fight and not yours. It is for your sake that I live. Now, one we are here, let me handle this. My prince, what? allow your mother. 
I believe you. You are welcome, my friend. How are your people now? We are good. Good to hear that you and your people are good. Yes. I really wish I was happy like you. Because I'm really not happy. I'm down myself. When you asked me to come, I knew there was a problem. Serious one. And it's just one problem. One like this. Now ask me who is the problem. My brother. He's just 14 days older than me. And he will not allow me to have peace. He will not allow me to take charge of this kingdom. Huh? What am I supposed to do? According to my mother, I'm supposed to take over. You do not need the opinions of a woman. No, no, not just a woman. I'm talking of the queen of this land. No, queen or not? She's a woman. It's my mother we're talking about. Listen to me. You have to take your destiny in your hands. And anything that stands in your way is an obstacle. Of course. And you know what we are supposed to do to obstacles. If need be. Ah, it says in what you said. Of course. <laughs> you are right. Except that I cannot take the life of my brother. He is my blood. I cannot take his life just because I want to sit on the throne. We have to find another way out. Your blood? Yes. <laughs> I cannot kill my brother. Is your blood an obstacle to you or not? He is. Then what are we saying here? But I still can't kill my brother. We have to find another way. What of, what of compensating him with something he would? Like what? Maybe just uh, give him some money or send him away somewhere. But I want him to be alive. I don't want to kill him. My friend, you should have read the signals by now. It is very obvious that your brother, whom you call your blood, has eyes on the throne as well. Of course, I know that. I can see it. Then you know what you are supposed to do. <sighs> I really wish I knew what to do. But I just don't know what to do, my friend. Eh? I want to look for something, think about something else. Another thing, apart from killing him. I just don't want to take the life of my blood. I can't do it. No. Listen to me. It comes a time in a man's life when you have to make a major decision. This is a major decision. It is obvious that your blood is an obstacle. Do you want to be a nogi or not? That's my destiny. Good! Be a man. If he remains an obstacle, then you know what you are supposed to do. I really wish I knew what to do. But I just don't know what to do, my friend. I just don't want to take the life of my blood. I can't do it. No. 20 years of friendship is not two days of friendship. That which you cannot do, I can help you do. Just say the word. Okay. I will think about it. When do you want it done? <laughs> I said I will. Tonight? Come over. Hey, oh. What's your boy? What's your boy? Come near now. Come near this way. Are you aware of me? <laughs> See, this Baba Mata. Eh? I am OTT. Call me OTT. No, Baba. I can't call you by your name. Why? Why? I ask you to call me by my name. Call me by my name. Leave those uh, Baba on the. Don't, don't worry about that. Eh? You know you're a fine girl. Here. Open my egg, Maroa. No, Baba. You know this is so unfair. What's your fate? Look, look, I will give you anything you want. You hear me? Right now, I am going to the palace, eh? To see the Nogi. Eh? Later, you we'll come to the house. My wife will have be gone then. You go to the market. Just come. Anything you want, I'll give to you. If it's money, even if it's land, I will give you. I have. Papa, but you are old enough to be my father. <laughs> Leave that one. 
Ils ont vu. 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 You mean that boy had the mind, the gods, the effrontery to do that? After the warnings I sounded the last time? Enugi Atokwe, you don't have to take any action in this world. After all, he's still our son. Um. Someone who are there here, I want him now. I cannot have a child who does not have my interest at all. Never. Now well, you should understand, my majesty. Age is of the flesh and maturity is of the mind. No matter how big all these kids are, they are still babies. They don't understand certain things. They don't. What are you sent for me? How true is it that you go about maltreating my people? The other time, you had a grown up man tied to a tree and began to flog him. After that, you beat up a woman. A married woman at the market square. And now it is the turn of the maidens. 